What's up, everybody? Hope you guys are having an awesome day. I'm Biscuit Dog, and we are back in Kenshi. Uh, we're with the Rat Boy, and we're in the empty bar at the moment. We are going to do some interior design today. So we're always talking about Shidan's interior and exterior design mod. Today we're going to use it. As you can see, we're in our new bar, our new barring facility. It's very important. It's a place we spend a lot of our time when we're at Fat City. Um, it's where we keep most of our food and kind of where everyone gets together after a hard day, bog man murdering or whatever we're doing. So uh, we spend a lot of time in here and it's got to look cool. I've got two tables at the moment. That's all I've got at the moment. But I want to show you guys what Shidan's interior and exterior design is really about and how cool this mod is. I've been saying it for a long time, but I haven't really showed you guys. So, let's get busy with this. Uh, we've just got roof decorate. Roof decorations has just been researched, and we've got now chairs are the last thing to research, and we can get building all kinds of crazy things. So, uh, with Shidan's interior design installed, uh, you'll find that you've got a lot more research options at your research bench once you install the mod. Things like ancient, ancient safe, barrier, broken drone, machine block, metal box. You can see the pictures of them here. So this is just the ancient items that he's added in. Uh, one really, really cool thing is those awesome safes. We can put a safe in. I mean, there's two kinds of safes, but this is the cool kind. This is the safe you find in the ancient labs. The rad safe. <laughs> uh, what, cannibal? Cannibal stuff? Butcher tables? Uh, we can use all this stuff inside the bar, though, too. Well, not all this stuff. Some of the stuff is crazy. <laughs> like the cannibal camp trophy is not really a welcoming thing. Uh, oh, wow. There's that building. There's tents. Wow. Uh, this is for outside, so let's take a look at this stuff outside. Here's the cannibal stuff. There's like a cannibal tent. This is the awesome thing. The cannibal, the big cannibal camp building. This is what I use as like my, uh, I use this as my copper mine building. I really like this building. It's a rad building. Uh, what else do we have? Butchery table, butchery table. These can all be kind of uh, bar counters or something inside the bar, but we'll see. Uh, more tents, cooking pit. That's pretty cool. That can go inside too. Oh, we should put one of those inside, because it looks like a, a spit. Old school rotisserie barbecue. Let's do that. That's pretty freaking awesome. Should we put it in the middle? I don't know. Yeah, the middle seems like a good place for a spit. Mm. We could put it in the middle, or we could put it on the end. What I was kind of thinking is doing like a kind of bar counter down here. Uh, and then having, you know, food and stuff stored behind it. This is probably the best place for it. Right in the middle. A centerpiece, if you will. Uh, we can put prisoner poles in. We can make them dancing poles, I guess. Spike cage. Uh, if, just in case a normal cage isn't nasty enough, you can have a spike cage now. <laughs> just to make slavery that little bit more awful. Wonderful. What else do we have? We've got so much cool stuff. Uh, he's added stuff to the, to the normal... He's added stuff to the normal menus as well. So in defense, there's the normal harpoon turrets, mounted crossbow, but there's also gun plank. I don't know if you guys have seen gun plank, but the gun plank is the most awesome thing ever. So you can attach the gun plank uh, to the roofs of your buildings, thusly. You can't put a crossbow on the end of it yet, but I think that's the plan. And when you can, that's going to be pretty damn cool. I think you can attach it to walls too. Yeah, you can. So the gun plank is like one of my favorite things ever. Even though it doesn't work right now. What else do we have? Exterior. So many exterior things. Chimneys. Chimneys are cool. Uh, Emperor statue. I don't know why we'd want that, but you can have one if you want one. Uh, exhaust pipes. Uh, these are cool too. The market tents. I really like market tent big. And you can build these if you're clever. You can build these on top of roofs as well, which is super awesome. You can have little shady spots. You know, like uh, Rat Boy's old house, his bed was under one of these. It was right there and there was a bed underneath it and that's where he slept. I think that's pretty cool. All kinds of tents. Long ones, small ones, big ones. It's great, you guys. Uh, we don't need any of this for the bar, though, I think. There's stalls. I wonder if we could put those inside. I don't know why we'd want to. I'm just, I'm just wondering. Doesn't look like it. There's outhouses. We need an outhouse. <laughs> we need an outhouse by the bar, for sure. It should probably be around the back here. Let's do that. Eh, nice and discreet. Nice and discreet. The shade cover is pretty cool too. It's like almost like a circus tent. It's pretty big. 
And it's got a hole in the middle, so you could put like a, you could find a good place with a nice tree maybe. Have the tree coming up through the middle, that'd be pretty sweet. Uh, this small water tank is cool, but I found out too late the last time I built it that it, it doesn't store water. Well, it didn't when I tried the last time, it may now. We could try again at some point. Uh, we got split rail fencing for outside, that's kind of cool too. So we can have fences. Uh, you could put fences around your buildings. Or you could have fences around your fields maybe, because raptors eat all your stuff. Uh, that's definitely a thing you could do. This weird crate is uh, well named, because it's super weird. I haven't, I've never built one, but it's a, it's a storage space. It's just strange looking. Alright, what's next? Farming. No, we know what all that is. Food, we know what all that is. We need, we need most of this inside here, I think. At least, at least the storage for these things. At least a bread oven, I think. Uh, interior, here we go. There's so much here. Armor stand, assassin training dummy bed, carpet, and rusty carpet. That's like a darker carpet. That's pretty damn cool. Interior walls, which are awesome. Very useful. I, I really wish we could build these outside too, um, but they're super cool anyway. Like, it would be cool to have a little a little wall between these two. And it's just cool to have walls sometimes, little wooden walls. You could block this off, whatever you wanted to do. Uh, but they're super useful inside as well. You could like have little private areas. Very nice. Uh, there's a metal interior wall. That's new. Pretty damn cool. Large basket, locksmith training box, metal table. That'll probably be the bar, I'm thinking. Old bed, that's a sweet bed as well. Uh, round table, we've got two of those already. Rusty sink, I've not seen that. Oh, it's a sink. Yeah, we're going to need one of those for sure. Uh, there's the old school traditional safe. Uh, shelves, there's freestanding shelves and there's wall shelves as well. So those are pretty cool. You can't put you can't place items on them from from what I know, but they're still pretty damn cool. Barrels, crates, small table. Yeah, that's also pretty cool. Support beams, just for uh, you know aesthetics. Ah, that looks pretty cool too. We could have maybe we could have maybe those on the ends of our bar. Yeah, it's coming together, guys. Support beam 2, what does that look like? That's a bit more interesting of a support beam. Does it actually touch the wall? Yeah, no one's going to see. It doesn't, but no one's going to see. Table, training dummy, tr training turret. Those are all normal items, by the way. It's just I'm just going through them. Double bed, that's a cool one, too. Ah, luxurious. And another partition. That's all from there. What else do we have here? Electrical torch post. All of these are standard mining. There's nothing new there. Power and storage. I don't believe there's anything new there. Tech. Research bench. Walls. No. So we have... A it's mostly an ancient... Ancient cannibal defense exterior interior. And that's pretty much it. But there's so many cool items. Uh, let's build this one. See how this turns out. We're going to need a lot of fabric for all this interior designing as well. So I think we've got some by now. One in there. Five in there. That's not too bad. How many in there? Nothing in there. How okay, let's just... She can keep making fabric. That's perfect. We're going to need some. <laughs> uh, thanks to whoever told me why there are two. <laughs> the reason there are two of these in each little cubicle is because they have buckets underneath. Um, so when one gets full, you can just use the other one. I was like, what are they doing? Two people in, in one stall at the same time. It was just weird to me. But thanks for clearing that up. Whoever cleared that up, I appreciate it. <laughs> Uh, and that's why I put two next to each other because uh, you don't want an uncomfortable, you don't want an uncomfortable minute there, in the stall where someone goes, someone knocks on the door and goes, uh, the seat taken? You don't want that. <laughs> it's better just to have two. Better just to have two. Let's get someone else on this building. I'm pretty sure that Dusty probably isn't doing anything. I knew it. Come on down, buddy. Let's just. Click construction so that you can get what you need. There you go. Did you get? Yeah, you got what you need. Fine. 
Fine, fine, fine. Ugh, Fat City still looks quite a mess. I really don't like this building here. But it's the most important building in Fat City at the moment. It's producing all of our food. So if if I'm gonna change it, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to like I'm gonna have to get the farm up and running in another location before I d dismantle this building or we're all gonna starve. So that's not ideal, but I really don't like where this building is. It's it's just not fitting in. It's kind of in the middle. It's just not good. It's not good, you guys. I'm gonna have to change it. Uh, but that's gonna take a whole long time and be very complicated. Come on, Dusty. So this mod's really cool because it gives you lots of freedom. It, it, I mean, this is meant to be placed outside, but you can place it inside. I like that about it. Uh, and it's a cannibal item, but it, it looks kind of normal. Some of the cannibal items don't look normal <laughs> at all. Like, the butcher table is disturbing, to say the least. Um, but I really like a lot of the cannibal items. That building, that outbuilding is really cool. I'm going to use it quite a lot inside the new Fat City. So you're going to see more of that outbuilding. I'm quite sure. Are both of these done? Sack shot, dude. What are you doing, buddy? We'll go get some. Alright, okay. A thing that can sometimes happen is that they, um, they stop building the item halfway through and then they can't find their way back to it. But if you if you make them engineers, if you make their role engineer and just let them roll, they'll generally run around town just building stuff. What? Who are you? Pfft. Whatever. Maybe we should just... Let's lock this, dude. Safety first and all that. <laughs> Alright, barbecuing facilities done. That's a step in the right direction. Uh, okay, we can't use it to cook with. That kind of sucks, but uh, it's okay. It's a good... Uh, it's got a nice atmosphere. I think we should put... Let's see if we can put a campfire in it, and that way it'll be on fire and look way cool. Uh, camping, campfire... Let, no... Why do you hate me? You shouldn't hate me. Eh, can we just like this? Oh, it's a little it's a little far away. Is that gonna con anybody? Yeah, it looks good from there. Okay, that'll do. That'll do. Okay, now we're cooking, literally. Oh rat boy. Okay, he's still busy on the toilets. Let's get a bar counter going in here. I know, maybe let's do it like this. This is a great idea, okay. So the whole bar is just going to be in the center. Let's do it that way. That makes more sense considering the layout, I think. We'll leave a door for them to get in here. Okay. Uh, and we'll put that one there when when we can. He's just in the way at the moment. Okay, let's confirm that. You get busy on those, my friend. Oh, that one. You can dismantle that one. Okay, build them all. Build them all. How are we coming to the outhouses? Ah. All right. Well, that's a definite. That's a definite uh, step up in comfort. <laughs> I think we have some on the other side of town. Let me go look. Whoa, Brom and them are still up here. That's good. We need hemp. We'll just keep farming that hemp. Keep going, you guys. What are you doing out here? That's not safe, Fergus. Get back inside. What are you doing? Uh, I'm pretty sure we do have two more toilets over here. Did we take them away? Oh, there they are. There they are. Good, good, good. Fun, fun. Ooh, that's a pretty cool carpet, gotta say. I like that. Utilitarian. It kind of changes the whole texture of the floor. You could have a, f a floor that looked like it was a metal grating if you used enough of this carpet. That's pretty damn cool. I've never used these carpets before, but I like these. These are cool. Stool. Stool. And stool. 
It's fine. We could probably... Yeah, we could fit four here. We don't need that, though. We don't have that many people. Okay, confirm that. Build some stools, guy. So in the next episode, we're going to do the clinic and the keeper's house. We've got to kit those out, too. we got to make some beds. Uh, there's a lot of building to be done around Fat City, but I'm not going to do it all with you on video. Uh, I'll do most of it off off camera because it's, it's not exciting building and then I think the next mission we got to make is is back to the claw because it's probably been overrun by raptors and there's the little issue of the mega raptor <laughs> we got to go sort that out so that's probably in the next few episodes we're gonna head back up to the claw and that's probably the thing we're gonna be busy with um, so yeah this is the bar so far I'm sure I'll have more of it done by the beginning of the next episode thank you very much for watching you guys if you enjoyed it please like and subscribe and I will see you next time peace